Holly Willoughby put the recent Philip Schofield controversy behind her on Friday when she and her friends enjoyed a 12-hour alcohol-fueled day at Glastonbury. The 42-year-old this morning host and her husband and Baldwin were seen riding in a helicopter to the highly anticipated festival. It was her first significant public appearance since Philip left ITV after admitting his affair with a much younger male co-worker on this morning. Holly apparently had a drunken 12-hour day out at Glastonbury on Friday, when the Arctic Monkeys were the headliners, putting her previous problems behind her. According to The Sun, she partied and danced till the wee hours of the morning with people including Princess Eugenie, Peter Crouch, Jamie Dornin, and Lily James. As Holly put her problems behind her and danced the night away, Holly was captured on camera enjoying the time of her life. Holly was happy and joking with her companions as soon as she landed, a source told the son about her day at the event, despite having access to the VIP Winnebago camping area, Holly was eager to mix it up with the throng. According to reports, Holly attended the Arctic Monkeys concert in the stands with football player Peter Crouch and his wife Abby Clancy. Prior to partying till two in the morning at the rabbit hole with people including actress Lily and Irish star Jamie, the presenter allegedly socialised in the VIP section. She was having a blast and dancing non-stop, the spectator said. Holly was happier than ever, and it was obvious that the tension of the previous several months had dissipated. Her former co-host Philip, 61, left ITV and was fired by his agency YMU after confessing to an unwise, but not criminal romance with a younger male co-worker. Holly has ignored the controversy surrounding Philip's departure since joining this morning again on June 5 and has introduced a rotating cast of co-hosts. Years passed before Philip finally acknowledged to the Mail on Sunday that he had lied about the tryst being simply a story. He continued by admitting that he had lied to his thenagents at the management company YMU, his employer ITV, his co-workers, and his friends. Then, in a remarkable succession of me culpa, he expressed regret for all the pain he had caused. Holly was forced to write a statement denying any knowledge of it, which had a remarkable cascading impact on the show and ITV. Although they initially met when he was 15 years old, Philip said he had not groomed the man. Attraction is attraction, he said. There is no distinction between the LGBT community and the heterosexual or lesbian communities. There should be no distinction. Homophobia enters the scene at this point. When he was 15, I went to the theatre school he attended, and that is when we actually first met, so there is a difference, yes. Leonardo DiCaprio accepts it. Nevertheless, the LGBT community does not. Leo, a 48-year-old Titanic star, apparently had multiple romances with younger women.